do you end up with stains like this after applying a mascara i'm going to show you in this video how to get rid of these stains so that you don't end up ruining your entire makeup for the day i'm going to make use of my blossom two-in-one mascara this is how it looks like so it has a part for the lower lashes so this is how it looks like and it has this tiny one that helps you get your lower lashes done perfectly and it has the part for your upper lashes also so this is how it looks like ensure that you have a close-up mirror okay you don't want to be something that's far off because you want to see what you are doing so i'm going to intentionally make a mistake so that you can just see how to get rid of it i have gone ahead to make that mistake on my face so what you're going to do is that you're going to allow it stay like that okay you're going to leave it ignore your problem ignore the situation forget about it for like a while go do the right things that you need to do then you come back to it and when you come back to it Ensure that you're back with well, this kind of brush that you use to do your brows. So I am back. I'm going to do everything else I want to do or that I need to do. And I'm going to get my up close mirror and put it here and just brush that part that has that stain. So you can see I have gotten rid of this side. I'm going to go ahead and get rid of the stain on the side of my eye. Okay, so the stain has basically been taken care of. It's just that it leaves this shadow-ish vibe underneath my eye. So I'm going to go in with my loose translucent powder and my sponge that I used to set underneath my eye because it has this sharp edge. So I'm going to go in and just dab it there to just clean up the stain from my eye so after applying this on my face i'm going to go ahead to dust it off with my brush so guys this is how we are looking i just finished dusting off the powder from underneath my eye and this is definitely not bad i mean from the stain we had initially at the beginning of the video to this this is definitely manageable and still can be used so if you learn this and you're going to try to recreate this when next you have your mascara smudge do like this video subscribe to join the family and turn on your bell notification so that when I drop my video on how to prevent it in the first place, you'll be the first to get notified. So with that, bye for now guys.